Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create restore point and later time you can go back to a previously saved restore point. Let's say after creating a restore point, you have installed some software or driver and then you found that your computer is not functioning properly. So you wish that you could go back to a previous state before the installation and restore point can to do that. I'm using a Windows 10 machine. So I'll go to the control panel. From the search control panel box, I will type in create a restore point. So under system, there's an option create a restore point. You select that one. In the production settings, local DC production is off. That means no restore point was created. So we'll go to the configure and then turn on system protection and then apply and okay. Then I will click on create, give it a name and then create again. So it is creating a restore point right now. So the restore point has been created. I click on close. Now after finding that the computer is creating problem, I want to go back to a previously saved restore point. So I open the control panel again. And from the search box, I'll type in restore. And then under the system category, I'll select create a restore point. And on the system protection tab, the system restore area has a system restore button activated. So I will click on that. It starts the system restore wizard. Then I will go next. And then it will show all the previously saved restore point. From the available restore points, I should choose which one is the latest good restore point after selecting the one that i want to go back to i will go to next and then finish it's gonna restore to that stage where i created that specific restore point when i press yes it's gonna take some time to restore and will take the computer back to the point when that restore point was created The system restore is complete. So login. And after logging in, it's showing the message that the system restore completed successfully. So I can close this window. I hope you found this video was helpful. If you would like to receive notifications on future videos, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and set up notifications by tapping on the bell. Thank you for watching.